usually I'm, you know, always jumping straight in and kissing yep. the guy. And I think this time I don't want to do that just yet because yep. it's like, I want it to be different. Yep. Is that cool? That's totally cool. There is a part of me that wants to kiss me, but as a gentleman, I'm you know, willing to just, you know, see how things go. Mm. I like the feel of your leg. Really? Yeah. Why, smooth? It's nice and smooth. It's smooth. <laughs> no hanky-panky, please. <laughs> I feel like your mother's in the corner watching. <laughs> don't worry, I'm a good she boy. She is, don't worry. I'm a good boy. <laughs> Hi, Mum! <laughs> I think we're both comfortable now with each other and we're both happy that it's connecting. So... I think it's down to, yeah, the physical attraction now. Okay, oh, hug. Gotcha. If there's a physical, it's like, yeah! <laughs> Touchdown. <laughs> See ya. My mum's out there. Oh, Jesus, I'm staying in here. <laughs> <laughs> the day with me went great. Like, we actually just got to bond a lot more and it was a bit more personal. And I think the connection now is even greater than it was from our last date. We dance really quite close and you could feel there was a bit of there was a bit of heart heart tremor yeah. going on yeah he was a bit shaking a little bit but yeah no we had lots of fun next couple in were grant and honor i never had a date to my school prom oh, so why not this is uh, she cancelled on me last night. Oh, you're kidding. So this is my making up for yeah, the, lost the time, time yeah the time i didn't have a a date oh, to my you. prom i've never had a corsage given to me before Hmm, smells good. It was really old fashioned and I like old fashioned value, so I thought that was really sweet. Actually, chin chin. We didn't say cheers chin before. Chin. Cheers. Is there like a, uh, do you have a, what do you say in, back home in New Zealand? Is there a, you know. Cheers, brother. Cheers, brother. Beach stairs, bro. Beach stairs, bro. Oh, parched. Parched stairs. Now, I haven't um, seen or felt your dancing skills yet, so would you do me the honour? Honour. I would of this love dance, to. If I can <laughs> find your hand, there we go. In terms of dancing, I think he had a little bit of rhythm. I think. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, we've got it. <laughs> We're going around. <laughs> oh, <what are> we... <laughs> oh, this is funny. I think we've had such a strong bond on the date so far. I look forward to seeing you again. Sounds good. Yeah. In the light. <laughs> In the light, yes. So you can actually. See that I'm Save not an up. ogre in, in real life. <laughs> I would be very surprised if she came to a decision based on, on my appearance, so let's hope it doesn't come to that. <laughs> I had a great time with, with Honor in the, in the room. The, the dancing was a shock. I'm, thankfully, I couldn't see her and she could not see me because <laughs> I, I think I probably made an absolute goof out of myself, but I did it with a smile on my face. Maybe he wasn't a good dancer, but he tried to make out that he was, because he said he wasn't, he didn't think he had rhythm, so. So you're happy? I you am, I am very excited. The third couple to go on their high school dance were Sharon and Stephen, for one last attempt at seeing eye to eye in the dark. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Good, how are you? Good, I'm just come over. I wanted to give him a second chance, so I took the flower in just as a prop to try and um, calm the situation between us and uh, as a bit of an icebreaker. I've got something for you. OK. It's the flower that you gave us right at the very start. Oh, OK, that's very there nice. There you go. We'll start over. What's that? You can give it back to me and we'll just start afresh. Oh, OK. Well, Is actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you two things. Oh, I'm going to give you... A corsage first that I put on your hand. That's very nice, thank you. And then I'm going to give you the flower. Ah, oh, thank you. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, special cuddle. Oh, nice. Thank I was you. just going to give you a kiss. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> thank you. And you can you. have a flower. Thanks. I thought it was a lovely gesture by Sharon and that she was willing to give me a second chance. Maybe it was a new start for the both of us. Do you want to do a slow dance so we can be. Oh, I don't okay. want to dance. All right. I can't dance, so you know, I suck, but anyway, what am I supposed to do? You don't know how to dance? No, I can't dance. Well, I was happy to have a dance, and he was a bit shy about dancing, so he had a bit of a shimmy, you know, and, you know, just, I tried to make him feel comfortable. I'm going to spin around there. Okay, go. cool, yeah, I, I can do that. I'm not that bad at dancing. <laughs> so you can dance? Oh, yeah, but, you know, I've got cooked knees. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh. I could feel the body language that he was putting out was trying to pull me a bit closer and I'm thinking, no, 
it's not going to happen. Yeah. No. Oh, here we go. There you go. All right. Well, thank you for the dance. Oh, is that it? That's I fine, started yeah. to feel a little bit uncomfortable, and I didn't want to give him any idea that this was going to go any further. No, I'm not going to okay. kiss you, no! All right, come on. <laughs> Sorry, but I'm not kissing you. That's cool. Alright. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Oh, very bad. What's happened? Very, very Tell us what happened. <laughs> What's happened? It was just <laughs> he was, it was terrible. I just thought I'd just try and sneak a kiss. Oh, you had a you had a crack. Yeah. I thought I'd I'd have a go just right at the end, but she wasn't uh she you wasn't, go for it. No, she wasn't to um What'd she do? Did she just full, like, brush you away? Yeah, or? she told me that she didn't want to kiss and then she just sort of walked off. So. Fair enough. Yeah, it's fair enough. After their series of dates, the time had come for the guys and girls to send out their invitations to the one person they wanted to see in the light. To Min. Nathan and Min wanted to see each other. And? To Honor. As did Grant and Honor. And although Stephen wanted to see Sharon in the light, did she feel the same way? What are you gonna do, girlfriend? I don't I don't know. I I don't know yet. There's a bit of pressure going into the light reveal now. All these dates, you've built up this suspense and uh, you know of what what's to come, and you've got this connection and chemistry and finding out about the other person purely in the dark. So you're going purely off what's in your imagination. Going into the light reveal, so uh, trying to look my best. But as a friend says to me, that makeup is cheating. <laughs> so generally, I think if he's not going to like me the first thing in the morning, then forget it. <laughs> <laughs> so today's the day where I get to see Min in the light. I'm feeling excited about it. I think it might be a little bit confronting when the light first comes on above my head and I think, whoa, what's going on here? And just to also not knowing what her reaction's going to be too. I'm feeling excited. I love the fact that he's just gotten on the bandwagon and, and had a laugh about getting married and I've got an idea of something I might do that's just going to make him laugh. The anticipation level was growing and I started to feel a little bit uneasy about just standing there. I felt a bit vulnerable. Was he smoking? Um, <laughs> he was nice. It wasn't like, oh my god, but he was nice. My my reaction was a bit like, oh, oh, oh no, really? Yeah, okay. Do you think he'll take the veil, like the veil, as a as a funny, or do, do you think he'll be like? Yeah, no, he's definitely taken it lightheartedly. So one thing that sort of got me, I think she is taking this wedding thing really, really seriously. She, <laughs> oh, really? she was all dressed up and she was wearing a veil. <laughs> Wow. And here's okay. me going in there thinking <laughs> in it was the going to be casual the and I was in there in my thongs. I thought, oh, oh, OK. So the wedding might be on, like, is all she after out of this sort of experiment is to find someone to marry. I think she's wanting that a little bit quicker than maybe myself. I'm up, Go boys. Turn, Wish me luck. Good luck, mate. And I'll be back Good with the full soon. report yeah, soon. All right. Look forward to hearing from you soon. It all comes down to this one, this one chance now to, to see how it all <laughs> is revealed.
interesting. Um, he's not what I expected at all. Really? I think I may have not touched it off. <laughs> Mate, she is an absolute stunner. So yeah. describe, describe. Come she, on. Well, she's got the totally toned, fit physique, you know, from cycling and jet black, or well, look like brunette or jet black yeah. hair, yeah. Um, and just the cutest smile and, and face. He had a massive leather jacket on, and it made him look <laughs> boxy. And then the oh, sideburns, I was like, oh no, it's the fox. <laughs> So, balcony or no balcony? Oh, God, I don't <laughs> that know. That's the question. Moment of truth, my friend, so out you go. Good luck. All right, catch you soon. All right, anyway, good luck. Have fun. Well, I'm really looking forward to seeing Sharon in the light. I had a good, you know, feel in touch whilst I was in the dark room, and I'm hopeful that, uh, you know, when she's revealed, that I'll be very impressed with what I have to see. I'm wondering, should I go in? Am I curious to see what he looks like? Is it really going to matter? Or should I just walk away and just know in my heart that it's not the right thing to do? I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I'm really looking forward to seeing Sharon in the light. I'm hopeful that when she's revealed that I'll be very impressed with what I have to see. I'm wondering, should I go in? Am I curious to see what he looks like? Is it really going to matter? I'm not sure what I'm going to do. My seeing Sharon in the light hopefully will confirm my views and ideas about her and um, hopefully she'll feel the same way towards me. How'd it go? Fill us in. Yeah, geez, just need to give me a couple of minutes because it's not going to be easy for us. She didn't turn up. Um, I didn't warm to the idea that she had a child. Yeah. And obviously for her, having a child is the most important thing and I, and I respect her for that. Um, unfortunately, I just tried to steal a kiss and um, I wish I hadn't have done that because oh, I really okay. regret it. That was hard. Breathe, brother. Breathe it out. That was hard. If I had gone to the light reveal, that would give him some sort of inkling that maybe this is going to continue, and I don't want to do that. I don't want to give him the wrong impression at all. OK, well, it's time for me to go now. Mate, well, mate. I had a great time with you in here. Yeah, so it's been it's really good, good, to good to meet you. To meet you. Yeah. So good luck, guys. Right, thanks, buddy. Good luck meeting the girls on the balcony. See you around the future, huh? Cheers. Hey, David. Down to two. Down to two. OK. With a storm passing through the house this week, now only two couples remain. After seeing each other in the light, will their love be washed away or will they find gold at the end of the rainbow? He's a great guy, he's really, really nice and Nathan seems like the type of guy that would just treat a girl like an absolute princess. So I definitely want to be on that balcony and learn more about Nathan. Well, he's not here. <laughs> Min and I have been talking about marriage the whole way through our, you know, our dates and it seems to be getting more of a common theme and I'm really thinking now is Min taking this too seriously, we're coming in with a veil and it's all coming to a bit of a reality, whether that is something she wants right away. I would love him to come. I want him to be there, but he has to do what's right for him, just like I have to do what's right for me. Hello. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so glad you came. <laughs> so she turned around, we you know, gave a big hug and kiss, and there was obviously the the uh, chemistry there that was there all the way through. 